Surrounded by forests, streams, acreages, and animals was the setting for an unfortunate incident where conservation officers were forced to put down a mother bear and two cubs. One of those neighbors was Gail Teenkamp, who bought her Coldstream property three years ago. I was devastated. I was absolutely devastated. We purchased here for a reason because we are in a wildlife corridor and it's an honor to be living where there's wildlife. She says the bears have never bothered her before and feels more could have been done to save the animals. I only know what I have observed of them, which is of no danger to me or anything on my property. So I can't say that for sure, but what I can say for sure is how they dealt with this situation was extremely inappropriate. For their part, conservation officers say this is never the outcome that anyone wants to see happen. You know what, the COs don't like to have to do that. I mean, part of our job is, is, uh, is protecting the public, protecting the public's property. And when we have to put down bears, it's probably the most uh, unpleasant part of our job that we do. Conservation officers spent over four hours on the property attempting to safely move the animals, but when the bears finally came down from the tree, a decision was made. Uh, the bears came down a second time. At that point, uh, the uh, sow bear put her ears back and charged at the officers, and she was dispatched by one of the officers who was there. At that point in time, the cubs were uh, also dispatched because they're not uh, of a, of, in a state where they would be able to survive the winter on their own. Teen Camp says she will be filing a report with the Ministry of Environment. Rogner Hagen in Kelowna for Castanet News.